Hello, uh, my name is Chien and welcome you guys come back to the Oracle Learning uh, tutorial. Um, today I'm going to show you how to handle the services of, of Oracle. So, you know, uh, when you install the Oracle database server on your PC successfully, uh, one of the services will automatically start up. Okay, so you can see on my screen, we have uh, seven services here. And uh, for now, it is start up, started up. And the startup attack is automatic. That means when you are when you open the window PC and all of this service will be automatically start up. Okay. So so how, however for the learning purpose um uh, and you are using the a uh, PC uh, don't have a lot of memory so maybe the services will take the PC to run slowly. Okay, so in my opinion, I think uh, when you study, you, you should op start up the services, and uh, when you don't study, you will stop it to uh, make the PC run faster. Okay, so uh, to, start, to start or stop the services, uh, uh, you can open the with the run and start the services dot msc here and then you find the service name is oracle here we have seven so we can uh, right click and property and we also can can turn it to manually manual and uh, click to apply button here and uh, also click to stop button you can start up tie to manual that means uh, uh, when the computer start up uh, the service this service cannot start automatically so if you want to it you want to start the service you have to open the service this dot msc and uh, right click on the service name and click to start up button here okay so uh, we can also stop it by right click by right click here. But we have for now we have a uh, seven services here, and uh, we do one by one. Yeah, I think it will uh, take a long time for you guys. So that means I I will tell you how to try the code in best file, and you can start or stop the service just by one click. Okay. So here we have a best file. This file is startup uh, for startup the Oracle services, and uh, this one is stop Oracle services. Okay, so now I will open the code for you guys. Here, it is uh, very simple. You only uh, start up with the keyword ESC and start, and this one is the name of service. You can get the name of service is by double click the service name here. You can copy it, okay, and paste it here, and okay, it's very simple for you. And now we come back to the, uh, now we go ahead to see the stop Oracle services screen. Okay, here, the first step we have to change the startup type to demand. demand. That means um, you change it from automatic to the menu. Okay, so after that, we will stop the service one by one here. Okay, so now I will show demo for you guys. So open the startup here. So just want to notice you, you have to run this uh, script in by the Administrator phone by right click to this file and run it. Administrator. Okay, so for now, the all of services is start up, so we I will stop it. Right click on this one. Run. Okay, it's very fast. Done. 
so now we try to refresh this one to see it is starting so we did one more time to open up service this is so okay that means for now all of services or change the state startup time into a manual and uh, the status is so for now okay so uh, so now I will open the startup service run at editor then come back to see refresh wait one more time Okay. Oh, this one starting. Uh, by default, for the learning purpose, uh, I think you only need to start the Oracle Console DD, Service DD, and the TNS Listener. The three services uh, that is enough for you learning. Okay. So that means for now, all of services is started. Uh, so, okay, so I will put the script into the uh, description of my video on YouTube. So, for example, after I upload the video on YouTube, you can find the script in the description here. For example, I will copy this one here and also the command for start Okay, so you guys can open the description here and copy it. For example, you can open some notepad or notepad plus plus. For example, here and you can save it at the any name that 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 dot that file and do the same thing for stop here you have here you and then you click to write and run as integer okay So uh, I hope this video tutorial will be helpful for you guys. So uh, I think it is uh, simple, but uh, it is uh, faster for you to handle the services uh, after you install the Oracle on your PC. Okay, so see you in the next tutorial and uh, let me know if you need more information. Bye bye.